I think we um, all have like that person in our family <laughs> around Christmas time or so when I married Philip he's the youngest of five and they had spouses and kids and and they did things differently Custom. than I would I was accustomed and of course my ways all right, right. <laughs> of course of course right. and then even other parts of the family you would go and uh, there's dinners with I think that person's drinking too much and there's the crazy person there. Mm -hmm. And so I just think there is this drama sometimes that comes when you bring families together. Yeah. And and as a, you know, as a pastor, oftentimes we'll tell people, because as we've spoken about this week, you know, people have unrealistic expectations about Christmas. Right. And so they keep thinking that this year it's gonna be different. Yeah. That I'm gonna go home to my family oh. and this year it's gonna be different. Mm -hmm. It's all gonna be good. And then it's terrible. <laughs> right? It's it's weird, it's sad, it's sometimes borderline's abusive, horrible, and then they come back and then they have to recover for months from their horrible Christmas. Yeah. And so as a pastor, we've started saying don't go then. Right. It's like, create your own thing now. Right. Ha, cre invite some friends over and create a new family mm -hmm. until, you, you know, and then when you get married, you create yours. You don't have to go yeah. where there's the drama. Hi, everybody. I hope you enjoyed this video. Subscribe today and you'll never miss a new upload. Thanks for being a part of our Better Together community.